Hey, thanks for joining me today. I wanted to share with you a process video of painting light codes that are channeled through Archangel Raphael. Now this is an excerpt from a very long video. You might not have seen this before, so I thought it would be fun to share my process. And there's also a channeled message by Raphael. Pop your questions down below and don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Let's see what's coming. Feels like if anyone can feel the energy, because I literally feel like my whole body is buzzing right now, which is kind of neat. I usually have music on too, but we will do this without because I'm feeling like these just want to be coming in. I find that these angel codes are kind of calligraphic in a way. Oh, what's that doing? That's interesting. And as they come through, I'm not even thinking about it. I'm just letting them go where they want to go. Yeah, these ones are interesting. It's almost like, um, what are those codes? Not the codes, but the symbols for the astrological signs almost is what this feels like. And the elements, the old style ones. And there is a preciseness that is being asked of me on these, which I don't usually get with the galactic ones. Those ones just come out really quickly. And this one is like, nope, it has this curve and that curve. So I'm really curious, as you guys are watching, if these have any meaning to you or if you are feeling any sensations or vibration or anything from it. And if you're catching this, because I'm going to put this on my YouTube channel, if you're catching this on the YouTube video, then please feel free to pop a question in below and um, Archangel Michael, or Raphael, I should say, well, they're both with me, but right now we're working with Archangel Raphael. He'll be answering through me, so that's exciting. And if you haven't checked out the YouTube channel, please do because it's really, it's such a, it's turning into a really, really neat community and people are getting on there and sharing their ascension experience. Ascension as far as being a starseed or a human having uh, this experience of sort of waking up and trying to figure out what the heck is going on and hey, I've got all these choices that I didn't even know I could have and how do we deal with that? It's it's quite fun. Oh, look at this one. I do find if I'm talking or I'm listening to music and my mind is preoccupied a little bit, then these seem to come through in a bit of a different way. Yeah, that's pretty neat, eh? This really does look like an astrological symbol. Yeah. Oh, there's some more coming. Okay. Oh, this one's going to be... Chick Jaggy, interesting. So the really neat thing about mica is that you can get a very translucent coverage with it so that it's very sheer and just adds a little bit of sparkle if you're doing a regular painting and you want to highlight something and it's very, very subtle. Or you can go, you know, full bore. I'll show you some of my test samples here. And um, you can see that it's one color in the light and another color as soon as you shift it. And it's a lot of fun to just play with the colors, but also how sheer and opaque it can be in both ways. So this is reminding me of that right here because you can see the purple through it. And this has got a line that's going to go straight through. And almost like a point at the end here. I am so having a Bob Ross moment. Anybody else? <laughs> I'm going to paint it like that. I could just say I'm going to paint a little tree right there, a happy little tree. Happy little angel code. Archangel Raphael is laughing at me. Because <laughs> I'm, 
being silly and that's the best way to do it you know you gotta just enjoy things and not try to take it so seriously so i'm hearing in archangel raphael's voice a big welcome to all of you that have come forward to enjoy this energy as it is being presented Know that you are loved and cared for always. If you wish to work with me, I am here always. You need only ask and I will be there. It is my absolute pleasure to be here working with you today. And do know that the energy that is coming forward is not necessarily in these paintings. Not necessarily in Tanya's voice as she is speaking to you. But the resonance and the vibration that is in this transmission. And as you know, the time is relative. So whether you are in this moment live, as you would call it, uh, versus being on the replay, it is the same. You are still part of the group of energies that are connecting and intersecting together in this now moment as we come together and work towards awareness and healing both of the physical body but all of the bodies that make up your beingness all of the bodies that make you your unique self all of the energies that are unique to you and so I am very pleased to be here and I do ask if you have questions for me to please share them in the remembrance that in sharing for yourself you are sharing for many others who may not feel that they are able to speak at this time for whatever reason they may be shy or not yet comfortable to ask but in sharing your knowledge and your experience, you are doing so for the collective. This is what I was speaking of yesterday to Tanya as we were working together, that there is a connection between all, and if you are here in this now moment, you are one who identifies as a highly sensitive being which means that you are one who wishes to nurture and care for all of those on the planet at this time, whether they are human, animal, plant, or the planet herself. However, it is important to know that you must take care of yourself as well, because many of you put so much energy into others. It is your instinct and your nature. And part of your journey here at this time is to learn how to do so for yourself as well. Because you cannot, as you know, care for others if you are empty. And that is vital for you to understand and to recognize. So I do ask that you take a moment to be conscious of that as you are going through your current existence in this now moment. And to... Allow yourself to be a cheerleader for yourself as well and to know that you have done so much, so, so much, dear one. And for now, I will step back and enjoy these wonderful energies that are coming through. Part I am sharing, part which are Tanya herself, although she doesn't yet feel confident that that is true, but that is the truth. <laughs> Thanks, Raphael. <laughs> You are most welcome. Uh, and I will be here, my energy and resonance, in this frequency, this recording, and the work that she is doing. And I will step back now. Oh my gosh, that was trippy! <laughs> well, hello, it's me, Tanya, back here again. That was cool. I haven't done that live before, so that turned out beautiful, didn't it? Look at that. Wow, I'm really loving that. Oh, someone was saying it's very magical. Well, thank you. Um, I'm not sure if you meant Raphael or me or the painting. But I love how that turned thanks. out. Thanks. 
Yeah, this is fun. What do you think? Should we do another one? I think we should do another one. I'm feeling the energy to do another one. That's cool.